welcome back to my channel today i'm so happy to have you stop by today to watch my video so guys in today's video i'm going to show you a remedy to get rid of eczema naturally we've heard and we've seen people with this particular skin disease and it's my pleasure to bring to you this natural remedy to get rid of eczema if you suffer from eczema or you know anyone that suffer from eczema that it's been a tough time getting rid of now this one is going to work really well for you or for anyone whom you know is being affected by eczema eczema is a name given to a kind of dermatological medical condition that mostly affects children sometimes infants and uh, infant children and sometimes adults when eczema is on someone like it's very easy to identify sometimes eczema appears mostly on the face on the hands it can appear on any part of the body sometimes on the neck region and all of that so whichever area your eczema is you just show that you can get rid of them by applying this remedy i'm about to share with you in today's video some symptoms of eczema could be dry skin could be thickened skin could be kind of flaky skin it could be redness it could be swelling and sometimes itching that can extremely be unbearable which if when you scratch causes it to really appear visibly that there is an eczema on the plate. So the first thing we are going to do is to get aloe vera. So aloe vera is very good for the treatment of eczema because aloe vera itself has some enzymes and some chemicals that are very good in combating the skin disease eczema. So this is how we are going to prepare our aloe vera. So you're just going to get your aloe vera and you get a kind of a little quantity of the aloe vera will be enough I'm making use of the aloe vera gel here is the aloe vera gel so you can blend this or you can either use it like this so let us say for instance the eczema is on the face you just go around and rub it on the affected area like this rub it in a circular motion After rubbing it like this, you're just going to leave this to dry on the skin. So you're not leaving it for any particular number of minutes. You're just going to leave it until it is dried on the skin. So if it takes 5 to 10 minutes, you should just be patient to see that it's dried on the skin. After the aloe vera dries on the skin, we are going to make use of our apple cider vinegar. Why is it best to use your apple cider vinegar after your aloe vera? It's best to use it because apple cider vinegar has some antibacterials that kills the bacteria that causes this eczema. So you just use it, it's very fine. So this is what you should do with your apple cider vinegar. Get your apple cider vinegar, get a can and just add little of the apple cider vinegar. So you mix this whenever you want to do it and add little water with it. So you're going to add same quantity of water of this apple cider vinegar here. So you're just going to add very little quantity of water. Now, what I have here is more than the apple cider vinegar that was inside, so I'm going to add a little more apple cider vinegar. So I have diluted this with water already, so you're going to get a cutting board and you're going to apply it on the same area where you've applied your aloe vera that is dried on the skin already. And you're going to let it dry again. When it is dried, you get warm water and you're going to wash it off with warm water so i'll just go right into the bathroom and wash this off with warm water and i'll tell you what next to do after washing off your apple cider vinegar from the face you're going to get coconut oil rub it gently on it so you should do this every morning and every evening before you go to bed So and that's that guys, I hope this video has been helpful to you, if this video has been helpful to you, don't forget to give this video a thumb up and don't forget to drop your comments down below, let me get your thoughts about this video and do not also forget to share this video on all your social media platforms, you never might know all oh, this video will just be helpful to you guys, I'll see you in my next video, bye bye.